Good afternoon, I'm John Perkins, the Closing Market Minute. Soybeans were modestly higher on Tuesday, seeing an oversold bounce after the recent losses while keeping an eye on the very slow tail end of this year's U.S. soybean harvest. Gains, though, are limited by the generally good crop conditions in most of Brazil and the uncertainties about phase one of the trade deal between the United States and China, conflicting statements on Tuesday from Commerce Secretary Wilbur Ross and President Trump. Corn ended the session mixed on commercial spread adjustments. Nearbys were down, deferreds were up modestly. Corn's also watching U.S. harvest activity, with more delays expected in northern parts of the region over the next few days. Some of that just might not be harvested until spring. And wheat ended the session mixed. Chicago and Kansas City were down, with nearby months sharply lower in an effort to make prices more competitive, while Minneapolis is up on oversold signals. Live and feeder cattle were mixed ahead of this week's widespread direct cash cattle business. Asking prices were 122 live and 193 plus dressed, while packer inquiry remained very light. Box beef was mixed at midday. And hogs ended the session mixed, also on an oversold bounce similar to soybeans, but with gains limited by the continued uncertainties about China. Cash trade was mixed during the session and pork was down at midday. I'm John Perkins with the Closing Market Minute.